Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to your favorite channel. My name is Randolph and I'm back again with some more Pokemon TCG openings. Today, we're opening something that I've never opened before and we are opening this Jumbo, Charizard and Reshiram Tag Team GX box. So it opens up like that and you get four packs inside. You get a big Jumbo Charizard card. You get a big, well, not a big, a regular sized <laughs> Reshiram and Charizard card. And you also get the, well, a little toy there. So we'll see that in a second. I'm also going to be opening this Mewtwo Shining Legends pin collection, three packs in there. Shining Legends is a set that I kind of wish I did open, but didn't. And then to top it off, we will be opening six Cosmic Eclipse packs as we continue our road to complete Cosmic Eclipse series. So, first things first, let's get this Charizard box open. There's a code card if any of you guys catch it. Okay, first of all, we have the toy, which is pretty cool, you know. Damn, that's pretty sick. That's going to stay on my shelf somewhere or on my desk, maybe. Damn, pretty nice. I mean, I didn't really buy this for the toy, I bought it for the cards, but that's pretty sick. Nice one. We can leave that in the background when we actually open the packs. Here we have the packs themselves. We have two we have two Unified Minds, one Unbroken Bonds, and a Breakpoint, XY. Okay. Then we have the, well, pretty beat up, to be honest, Jumbo card, which, damn, look at the artwork. That is sick. You got Reshiram here and Charizard back to back, looking like they're going to go fight some evil forces. Then we have my... You know, the, the card that I really bought this set for, and that is this right here. The textured Reshiram and Charizard promo card. I don't have one of these yet, so this is my first. Off-centered, but <laughs> you never know. Let's leave that up. Boom. And now, guys, let's get into these four packs here. Let's start with the Breakpoint pack. This is XY, so I may mess up the code card, but it is what it is. Which way is it going to be? Okay. There's the code card. I think one, two, three. Okay. Right, seems to be going well so far. I wish they just kept it consistent with the packs, you know. We have Swanner, Cloyster, Krikatoon, Froakie, one of the best Pokemon ever right there, Ferrisseed, Electabuzz, awesome artwork, Staryu, Blitzel. We have, okay, we have a nice one. This is what they call a break card. I was never a fan of these. I think they're one of the most ugliest cards I've ever seen in my life. And I hate how you have to turn it on its side, but you know what? We'll take it regardless. So I do apologize if I'm not hyping this card that much. And then last but not least, we have a Ferrothorn. So I guess we will sleeve this up, but personally, I'm not a fan of the way they look. That's just me. Especially when you're going through a binder and you like, have a card on its side. Not a fan. Moving on to the Unbroken Bonds pack. Now, let's leave that one last. That's That, that has the chance of actually getting the Rainbow Ray, Reshiram and Charizard. So we'll leave that one until last. Just to build up the suspense, you know. I always feel like if I leave a card there, the cards inside of it get better. Even though that's not true because obviously the cards are the same no matter what. Ever since they're put into the packets in the factory. But we like to believe, okay? We like to believe. We have a Water Energy, a Dragonair, beautiful artwork. Delmise. That's nice. I haven't seen this artwork before. Um, well, surely I have. I think I have. Obviously, I have, I have the whole Unified Mind set. So I, of course, do. Lovely Heracross artwork. Hone Edge. Sneasel Washington. Let's go, my guy. Magnemite. Slackoth, Aksu, we have a Reverse Hollow Slumbering Forest, and we have a Executor as the rare card. Sneasel Washington, I'm not sure what... It, is that becoming a thing as well, like Snake Backwards? It very well might be. Especially now we're opening a lot of Cosmic Eclipse, and it appears to be that there's no Ekans in Cosmic Eclipse. How are you going to have like 236 cards in one set and not have Ekans, man? What are they playing at? I've also put my chair a little bit higher, and my camera a little bit further away, and for me, this is working a lot better. Let me know how it is for you guys. Energy, Heracross, Coach Trainer, awesome with the Pikachu in the back. Cresselia, nice one. Joltik, Salandit, Ryolu with the rainbow in the back. Meditite, Shroomish, Reverse Hollow Unidentified Fossil, and we have an Unpheasant. Damn it, I feel like whenever we do these like collection boxes, I never get anything good, man. I never get anything other than like a hollow or a rare card or a break card. And it's down to Unbroken Bonds, the last pack for this little section of the Charizard box. If we're going to do a whole Charizard box and we're not going to get something special, I'm going to riot, man. Okay, we have a Leaf Energy as a starter card. We have a Haunter. Love that artwork. Lieutenant Surge's Strategy. Seen that. Oh, Electromagnetic Radar. Is that what it is? In my Japanese openings, I keep calling this the Pokemon Etch-a-Sketch. <laughs> Grooving. Oh, I thought it had like a misprinted hollow on it, but it was just a piece of glitter. Geodude. Swinging across some rocks. That's cool. Litten. Let's get lit. Froakie. Best Pokemon ever. Or one of. Reverse Hollow Welder. 
Nice. We know a lot about Welder. If you watch my other videos, you'll know why. And last but not least, we have a... Ooh, with a Lucario holo card. So, at least... Well, to be honest, that box was pretty trash. Like, other than getting the Reshiram Ram and Charizard promo card and this nice little toy right there, which I'll put like that, I guess. No, I'll leave it up like it's meant to be, like that. We didn't really get anything special, which is pretty frustrating. I mean, I'm not saying you're supposed to get something in four packs, you know, but when you get a box, you like to get something decent in it. Let's see if this Shining Legends Mewtwo pin box has got better pull rates. I found that when I was doing my Mewtwo and Mew um, Hidden Fates pin collections, which I wish I filmed. <laughs> I felt like they were better. Here's the code card for this entire tin. We'll get the packs out. Luckily, these are three Shining Legends. Got a Mewtwo pin. I could wear that, but I won't. We have a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful Mewtwo promo card. Uh, and, and I told myself that in Sword and Shield, I'm going to get every single promo card that's out there. So you see in the corner, this has SM77. So this is the 77th promo card in the Sun and Moon series, I believe. So I would like to collect every single one in the Sword and Shield era when that's out. And it does make sense, you know, and I think it's doable. If I'm going to be doing videos and I'm going to be opening every new sealed product that comes out, it makes sense that I'll be able to collect all the promos. Hopefully, fingers crossed. And look at these pack arts. Damn. Would look, I'd love to get that card, the Shining Mew. But look who's back, baby. Mewtwo on the front of the pack. You guys know how I feel about that. And you guys know the relationship that Mewtwo and I have. So let's open him first, get him out of the way. We'll open Mew last. And let's see what we get in this set. I'm not exactly sure on the card trick. So let's just see real quick. First of all, which way is the code card facing? Okay, there we go. Nice one. We're going to do four from the back like normal. And hopefully it's an energy on the front. Yes, okay. Had a sneak peek. And ladies and gentlemen, in this pack, we do have a Fire Energy, Pokemon Breeder, Lily, Ultra Ball, good card. I use this a lot on the TCG online. Buizel, Scraggy, Croconaw, I love that Pokemon. Jinx, Pikachu, nice, with the rainbow in the back. We got a Reverse Hollow Stunfisk. I don't want to give any spoilers out, but there is a certain Stunfisk in a certain game coming up soon. And last but not least, we have a Marshadow Hollow card which doesn't seem very hollow at, at, at the start. I didn't really notice that until you actually, you know, tip it back. That's nice though. We got a hit on the first pack, unlike the first Charizard box. Next up we have Genesect, and I do believe you can get a Shining Genesect in this set. I do have the Shining Arceus, but I bought that on eBay separately. I'd love to grade that card. I guess I might start, I guess I could start a collection of the Shining cards back in the day and then also continue them with the new Shining cards. If you don't know what I mean by a Shining card, Laura put a picture on the screen right here. We have a Water Energy, a Great Ball, How, Incineroar, fire, firing up some fire out of his dick, Pikachu, Jinx, Shroomish, Minon, shout out to Base Set Tom. I know you're watching, bro. Greater gem, link in the description. Go and check those guys out. Quillfish. Oh, reverse holo Pikachu. Nice. And we have a Palkia. Nice one. So this is also a small set. This is like Hidden Face, I believe. It's very similar to Hidden Face, as in it wasn't like a full set. So maybe I could open some Shining Legends packs and finish the whole collection, you know? Let me know if you guys would be about that life. And last but not least, we have Mew. Come on, Mew. In Hidden Face, you give me the good good. Let's see if you can replicate that in Shining Legends. Code card is right there for your beautiful people. Your beautiful people. You beautiful people. Oh, we got to flip it. So we'll guess the energy card. Water. Again, I get the energy card that is super effective to my type. Go Lurk. Floatzel. Scrafty. Torkoal. Pikachu. Jinx. Shroomish. Minnan. What's up, Tom? Reverse Hollow Spirit Tomb. And come on, give us a shine in. Oh, okay, we don't have a... Okay, we have a Manaphy. Do you get a Hollow in every pack? I'm starting to think you might get a Hollow Legendary card in every pack, being as we got a Palkia Manaphy and a Marshadow back-to-back. -back. No complaints from me, though. No complaints at all. They're still very beautiful cards. I would have liked to get a Shining card, though, I do have to admit, but it's okay, though, because we do have six Cosmic Eclipse packs on the way. We're going to stick... We're going to put these baby packs right there and open that one at the end of the video. I'm going to move this toy because it's in my way you know what i'm gonna clear the space yeah we're gonna clear the space right here to make way for the cosmic eclipse as we continue our road to complete series as you can see in the back i've got a booster box that i ended up breaking into and uh decided that i'll open a couple of packs in every single video i do no matter what set it is just so we can continue our cosmic eclipse series and then every now and then i'll do another elite trainer box opening or i'll do a you know 20 pack opening or something like that the code card here is right there we'll do four from the back and come on Give us something good from Cosmic Eclipse. I would love that, obviously. 
Belba and Bryson, man. Okay, I'm glad that I know their name because I kept getting one in my Tag All Stars box, especially a reverse hollow one, and I didn't know what it was called. So Belba and Bryson, man. Uh, again, the tag team cards are really cut up in the corner. We have a Clefairy. Let me zoom in a bit. Ambipom. Oddish. Ralts. Sandy Gast. Shviel. Cottony. Ponyard. And we have a Dragalge. Okay. Dragalge. I'm not sure how you pronounce that Pokemon. Let me know if you know. You guys know I'm not the great with pronunciations. Next up, we have a baby pack. Okay. Okay. These are usually good for me. Code card right there. Four from the back. I'm going to go with a fire energy for this one. Damn, it's fairy. Incorrect. Golduck. Will. Nice. Shout out, Will. My friend from school. Mimikyu. Rowlet. Phantump. Alolan Grimer. Gross. Magnemite. Eve. Reverse Holo Curlia. And a Raichu. Looking all cool, but not what we want. I think we do already have Raichu, I believe. I do believe we do have a Raichu. Come on, come on. These Cosmic Eclipse packs, I know they have something in it, because like we opened four a video not too long ago, or I guess quite a while ago. I don't know. Code card. All right. I'm going to guess the energy, and that means we're going to get something good in this pack, you know? I'm going to guess metal. Yes! Let's go. Let's go. I also realized we didn't do any first pack look in this video. I just stormed straight into it. So, what pack is this? Is that eighth pack? Hashtag eighth pack look in the comments because we've got metal energy. Herdia. I know this one's going to bang. Tangrowth. Primplup. Super Sad Eevee. Duskull. Timpole. Flabebe. Alolan Sandshrew. Steelix. Let's go. I always get shocked when I see these cards. When I see the character cards, I do get super shocked. And that's only because, like, I haven't seen them before. They're completely new to me. So I'm like, wait, what's that? And we have a Sylveon as the rare. So this is a little bit off-centered. And I do believe I've already pulled a Steelix. But it is such a beautiful card. Laura said this card freaked her out a little bit. Especially the eyes. But I love how the eyes are hollow. So yeah, we don't complain. We don't complain on Randolph Games. Although I will complain if I don't get a GX you know, or something. Code card. You know what we need? We need like a mascot. We need a snake backwards or a sight of energy. And I feel like it is Sneasel Washington, you know. Did I do the cards? Yeah, I did the cards. Okay. So I'm not going to guess it this time. We need, we, yeah, we need a Sneasel Washington, mean ass Pikachu, Rowlet, Fantrump, Magnemite, Lillipup, Reverse Hollow Dewpider, and. Zoom in for the final one. We have a. Hey, let's go. That is so off centered. That is so off-centered. Look at that. Look at how much bigger this side is than that side, but it's okay. Luckily, I've pulled this card already, but we don't mind if it is off-centered. It's still a beautiful card, still a beautiful illustration. And you know what? I can grade the other one that I got, and then I can put this one in the binder. So that's all good. No worries there. And I'm glad we actually got something to shout about in this video. We finally got a GX card. Brilliant. Next pack, however. Still looking for that Sneasel Washington. All right, we'll guess the energy. We're going to guess Lightning. Damn, dark again, two in a row. We have Roxy, Professor Oak setup, Pyro, Tangela, the school, Timpole, Prim Piplup with the weird body, Cosmog, Reverse Hollow Passimian, and we have a Wild Rain rare card okay so i guess ladies and gentlemen it comes down to this one pack that is remaining and that is a cleffer igglybuff and togepi pack baby pack as we've been calling it come on this is the one last pack prayer signs in the comments let's see them this card is super beat up so if that is a gx i'm gonna be fuming can you see that like you see it now watch this be like a sick card okay we got a fire energy Mallow and Lana, Floet, Roxy, Chinchow, Cosmog, Pancham, Drillba, Tangela, Reverse Hollow Ducklet, and we have a Magneton Hollow card, which, you know, I wish it was a GX or something, but because I can see that serious, you know, printing defect there, yeah, I'm glad it's not like a Charizard Rainbow Rare card. Put it that way. And you know what? Because I'm addicted to these cards, we're going to open two more. A treat for you guys. Come on, come on. Let's get some dim. Let's get some dim. Okay, finally, we have a stupid ass Whelmer. This have some sort of favorite in the pack. You know, that brings us a look. You know, if you didn't put a prayer sign in the comments before on the last pack, make sure you do put one in the back for these two packs. I'm going to go Fire Energy, Fairy. We've got Draw Energy, Unidentified Fossil, Rapidash, Stupid ass Whelmer. Thank God I've missed him. Pawniard, Togadamaru, 
Trapinch, Flabebe, Reverse Hollow Excadrill, which is a rare, so that's good at least. And we have a Sunflora. Urgh, okay. I don't seem to remember packing that, however. I know I got one in my Japanese openings, but I'm not sure about my English one. And guys, last chance. You had two chances already. If you haven't put a prayer sign in the comments already, pause the video, go down to the comments, put a prayer sign, and let's get this party started, baby. There we go. There's a code card. We have one, two, three, four. I'm gonna go with lightning. It's leaf, but that's okay. We're gonna blast through it. We got Tropius, Mimikyu, Lily's Pokedoll, Oddish, Rufflet, Piplup, Alolan Vulpix, Rockruff, Reverse Holo Bishop, and we have, let's go, come on, we have a Volcarona GX. Get him, baby. That is a new pull. I haven't got that one yet. And look at that. Volcarona is one of the best Pokemon that exists, in my opinion. Should have been a legendary. In my mind, it is a legendary. Let's go. And I told you guys the prayer sign works. Don't doubt the prayer signs. Heavily off center, which is a theme in this pack opening. I hope it doesn't mean the whole booster box is off center in the GX cards. That would be annoying because if you look, they are very similarly off centered. So I wouldn't be mad about that if that's the case, but no worries. I still need to fill the binder. Laura has still got the percentage ticking up in the corner. So I'm happy. I'm happy. So guys, that is it for this video. Let me quickly demonstrate or go through the pools. Not demonstrate. Might seem like I'm some sort of gymnast. We have obviously the Reshiram and Charizard GX card promo that we all came to. Well, that's the box that we opened originally. We have a stupid ass break card. Don't care about that. We have a Lucario Hollow, a Mewtwo with the Galaxy Hollow, which I love. I love. I love. Marshadow, Manaphy, Palkia from Shining Legends. We have a Steelix character card. We have a Magneton, and we have Togepi, Cleffa, and Igloof. One of the best pulls of the video, I would say. And then we have the brand new card to our collection. This is our collection, you know. Yours and mine. You're seeing every single pack that I open of Cosmic Eclipse, and it's annoying. I used to buy booster boxes, okay, and I would open six of them in one day. But now I have to stagger them to make content for you guys. So I hope you appreciate that because I'm dying to know what is in these boxes. I'm dying to know. So leave a like on the video. Let's see if we can smash a thousand likes. That is the goal. A thousand likes on this video. See if you guys can hit that for me. And yeah, thank you guys for watching. As always, leave a like on the video. Subscribe if you want already. My name is Randolph. Let me know your favorite card that I pulled today. Let me know if you're still watching right at the end. And I will see you guys tomorrow for the next video.